Welcome back, no intro video. This look is gonna be done with the Kat Von D Monarch palette. I'm starting off with the color Killing Jar. I'm gonna be using Killing Jar as my transition color, and I'm gonna be sweeping that through my crease. Um, it's, it's, it's gonna come off a little darker than I would like, and I'm gonna fix that later. The next color I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use that top color, and I'm, that is the um, Tiny Death. And I'm going, yes, y'all heard me right, Tiny Death. And I'm going to use that as my brow bone highlight. And I'm going to sweep that in and I'm going to actually blend it down into the Killing Jar there. Yes, very interesting names here. So yeah, that's <laughs> my first time using it. So to lighten that up or just to create a better transition than I felt like the Killing Jar did, I'm going to actually put on a little bit of soft brown there, a little bit of MAC Soft Brown, which is my traditional transition color anyway next I'm gonna go in with um, deadhead deadhead is that nice rusty orange brownish color that I really really like and that's what really prompted me to actually get the palette because I really like that color and I also saw luster Lux use this palette she created a very nice smoky eye if you don't know about her please go follow her she's amazing balls anyway I'm just sweeping this through my crease, but I'm also putting it a little bit on the outer V area right there to set up the next color. The next color I'm gonna go in with, I'm going to go in with <clears throat> Vanish. And I'm gonna be putting Vanish on my lid, I believe. Yes, I'm gonna be putting Vanish on my lid. And this is a pretty nice color. It almost reminds me of expensive pink, but not quite. Um, but yeah, it's a very pretty color it comes out too. The next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to go in with two colors. I'm going to go in with um, Wrath, and I, I want to say that color is Papilio, and I'm going to use a pencil brush to put both of those colors on the outer V, very specifically on the outer V, and I'm going to pack those colors in. I went down first with the brown, which is Papilio, and then I went over that with the Wrath, which is the black smoky color. Then I'm going to go back in with Deadhead, and I'm going to blend these colors out with Deadhead. And you will see that you're still gonna create some smoke, right? But when you blend it back with your transition color, that color that we use to deepen the, trans the crease, it's going to fade it out, but the depth and the smokiness will remain, okay? So it's not quite erasing it, it's just uh, giving it a nice smoked out, lighter smoked out look. And that is the completed eye. I've also placed some cap, um, excuse me, <laughs> Coco Soho lashes with two red cherry wispy lashes on top. I have the Desio uh, creamy beige eyes on. Yes, I'm gonna go in with that middle highlight color, Telepathy, and I'm gonna use that as my tear duct highlight just to open up the eyes a little bit. Yes, honey, yes. I absolutely love that color as well. The um, colors in the palette are a little bit funky they um, have a tad bit of fallout but it still works I'm going back in with the dead head and I'm going to sweep that in my lower lash line and create a little bit just a little bit of color right there I don't want too much I don't want to smoke out the bottom I still want to keep the eye pretty open um, next I'm gonna go in I've already done my face I'm going in with makeup forever's matte bronze number 40 yes don't nobody talk about my edges okay don't come for me, okay? <laughs> About them edges. I know you're supposed to gel them down, but I have time for all that, so yeah. Okay, I'm going in with MAC Center of Attention, and I'm gonna use this as a brow, excuse me, as a cheekbone highlight. And I'm gonna put that down. And um, yeah, y'all know I go in heavy with that, but I'm kinda light today. I'm gonna top that off with just a little bit of NARS's Albatross. Yes, very unlike me, I know, but. I'm taking that albatross all the way around to my highlighted points, uh, including the chin and the tip of my nose. Yes, so um, next I'm gonna go in with a little bit of Max Mineralized Charge Water with some vanilla pigment in it. Yeah, wash those eyes there, okay. I'm going in with Viva Glam number two, which is a nude pinky lip. Uh, I really like this color. I don't use it as much, but uh, my hand just reached for it today, so I'm going with it. And I believe I'm going to actually line my lips with cork lip pencil. And yeah, I can't stop myself. Y'all know how I am with lipstick. And oh, excuse the uh, unfocusedness. Yes, going in with, but that's cork lip pencil right there. <laughs> 
and I am also out of focus but don't I look hot and fabulous though hmm but anyway I'm going to top that off with Nars's uh, Turkish Delight yes Kim K's favorite hey well I don't know what her favorite is right now but what if <clears throat> but anyway I'm putting that on and as you can see yes I don't know when to quit here either <laughs> But I really, really like the way this look came out. Very soft, glam. Yes, honey, I love this lip gloss. I know I can't help myself. But the um, face is matte. Yes, we still on that matte train, first class passenger. <laughs> on that train to Matteville. If it's not matte, it gets the hose. <laughs> anyway, oh gosh, I thank you guys for supporting me, coming back week after week. Hope you guys have a wonderful week. Hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. And hopefully I'll see you in the next video. Giving face as I'm going out. Bye.